Hi, and welcome to a 10-minute ab workout. For today, we don't need much water and a towel. We're gonna have four exercises. Exercise one, we're gonna do crunches for 20 reps. Exercise two, leg raises for 20 reps. Exercise three, mountain climbers to 20 times each leg and 20 minutes plank. Please go at your own pace. If you need to slow down, then press pause during this workout. If you need to go faster, then just go faster. We're going to do one round, then take a one minute break, and then do three rounds total. It should take us anywhere between eight and 10 minutes. If you have 10 minutes to burn today, now it's the time to do so. Your abs will definitely be burning. They're going to be on fire. Let's get started. We're going to start with crunches for 20 repetitions. Hands are behind your head. Try not to interlace them and you're going up for 20. Here we go. One, two, three, I'm really focusing on squeezing my abs. I'm breathing out. 10. As I come up, breathe in, out. 13, 14, 15. And 20. No breaks between the exercises. The next one is gonna be leg raises. I'm going to put my hands underneath my low back. Legs are straight and I'm lifting my legs up. One, two. Try to keep your low back imprinted to the ground. Five, six, Seven. As you're going down, you go down slow. Try not to rush. Engage your core going down and up. If you feel like your abs are popping up, try to not bring your legs too far down. So go only to like here and then up. 16, 17. 19 and 20. Good job. Bring your legs in. Roll up. And we're going to do mountain climbers now. Legs are straight. Hands are right underneath the shoulders. Try to keep a long neck. And here we go. 20 times each leg. One, two, Make sure you're breathing. You're pulling your abs in. Twelve. I'm gonna count to forty. We're doing it slower. We're not running because we're feeling our abs work more this way. Here we go. 10 more. Two, three, four, five, seven, four. Good job. And 20 more seconds of a plank. Here we go. Now, I prefer forearm plank over straight arm plank. Ten seconds more. Three, two, one, and done. We're gonna take a one minute break now. That was good. Make sure you were drinking water. You can use a towel. I started sweating during the mountain climbers. When you're drinking water in between, try not to drink too much, not to fill up your stomach. There we go, 30 more seconds. We're gonna go for the second round. Form is more important 
and speed. Always remember that. Don't rush. Try to really focus on your form. Here we go. We're gonna start in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Here we go. Pulling my abs in. Breathe out. Nineteen, twenty. Here we go. Leg raises. Same thing. Here we go. Up. One. I tend to hold my breath so I have to remind myself to breathe it really helps a lot if you need to as I'm doing you see I'm getting tired I'm bending my knees here a little bit Five more. This is working our low abs. Good. Mountain climbers, 20 each leg. Here we go. Right away, hands are underneath the shoulders. And let's start. One, two. Really focus where you're working from. Try not to be too much in your wrists and your shoulders. You should feel everything coming from your abs. If you're feeling it too much in your wrists, it means you're not doing it correctly. Ten more. Good job, you're almost there. And let's finish with a plank. Go, 20 seconds. Five more. And stop. We have one more round to go. One minute break, one more round, and we're done. I'm already feeling my abs. You know, your first, the crunches, you're working here, the upper abs, then the second part we're doing on the low abs. The mountain climber, we're really working on the full core, and then, um, with the plank, you're also working a full core. We have 20 more seconds till the final round. Here we go. We're at eight minutes, so we're gonna go a little bit over the 10 minute mark. Five seconds, we start. Here we go. Let's get 20 right here. Final set. Make it your best one here. Upper abs are working. Feet are imprinted to the ground. Good job. 20. Here we go, 20 leg raises, two. If you want an advanced version of this, you're not going to put your hands underneath your body. You're gonna keep them on the side. I'm not at that level yet, so I'm just going like this. As long as you're keeping your back down at all times, 
that's what matters a lot. If you feel like it's popping up, then like I said, either bend your knees or don't go too low. Five more. Good job. There we go. Mountain climbers, final time. Knee comes as close as it can towards your arms. 12, 13, 14, here we go. Lots of core work here. 20, halfway there, here we go. We're getting tired now. I'm definitely feeling my abs are on fire. But I'm not gonna give up, I'm gonna keep pushing through. This is what matters here, 10 more. Here we go. Good job. And a 20 second plan. Here we go, start right now. Halfway there. Squeeze in those abs. Three, two, one, and stop. That was good. 11 minutes total, minus three minute breaks. No, it was only two minutes. So we did nine minutes active work. It was great. I recommend doing this workout maybe after you did a cardio session, you went on a run or you went on a bag. This is good to do if you have more time. Or, like I said at the beginning, if you don't have that much time, this is a great workout on its own where you can quickly do at home. I hope you like this workout. There will be many more to come. Make sure you follow me on social media. Hashtag Tennis with Emma with one M. Have a great day.